On those state police image maker Femi Joseph said those peddling the rumor would have seen the prompt response of the police if they were truly at the scene of the bank robbery. The police spokesman explained that the timely response by the police made the criminals to abandon two vehicles they came in and ran into the bush. He said the police are on the trail of the suspects. You don't jump, you don't jump into into a crossfire. You don't you don't just jump at the scene and begin to uh, to look for enemies. We were there, we were there right on time, and that explains why we had to engage them uh, as soon as they, they are through with what they are doing. But asking policemen to just jump into the trouble spot and be looking for suspects who are already stationed there could resort to fatalities. That is what some people don't know. But as soon as they were through, we engaged them. And that was why they had to run away and leave, uh, and, uh, and leave, and leave the, uh, the vehicles, the two vehicles that they came with. A six-man armed gang on Tuesday this week attacked a commercial bank in Iju, a current not local government area on those states, killing a female staff and injuring two other persons. Some youths in the area accused the police of being in the habit of extorting money from motorcyclists but could not respond to a distress call to foil the bank robbery. <laughs> Security has been beefed up in all banks in Ondo State. From Akure, the Ondo State capital, Jonah Omowa reporting.